My friends, you're in good company. This is kind of awkward. I'm standing behind you, so I should, I really ought to stand in front of you so that you don't have to turn around. We can get a better look at you, I think, because everybody's seen me before. Did you have any, uh, any difficulty convincing the recording company to release that record? Uh, <laughs> it's awful hard to say. We, uh, uh, tried to keep, we tried to keep them from putting it out. <laughs> yes. Really? Didn't you have yes. any faith in it? No, no, we didn't because we only had about four or five minutes to cut the record. And, uh, we, took it in, we took it in one take. That's wild. How long have you been married to this man? Seven years. He has a weird mind. Yes, he does. He writes strange things. Yes, he does. Are all of his songs kooky things like that? No, no. He has a lot of serious stuff he does, too. Oh, I read that in a little book. That was obvious, an obvious question. Yes, yes of course. <laughs> Were you always a singer, Jay? No, I just started... Uh, I still don't think I'm a singer. But I started doing whatever I'm doing about two years ago. What did you do prior to singing? Uh, I was writing songs and producing some records up in Nashville. Who convinced you to sing, as if I didn't know? Misty. Did you have any difficulty with that? Uh, yes, I did, but then he finally did it, and, and um, oh, about a month after that, some uh, some people came in the club, and they discovered us. They were legitimate discovery story? Yeah. Really what kind of a life do you lead now? Where do you live? Well, what's the name of the hotel? Uh, <laughs> you mean you moved back and around, you've forgotten your home already? Yeah. The Hollywood Plaza Hotel, we're staying at right now, but of course our home is Orlando, morning, Florida. This morning Utah. We were in Utah right. this morning. Okay. It's a terrible way to live. Do you have a home? Yes, we do. We have a home in Orlando, Florida. You think this change of uh, your life professionally, running around, singing all the time, is going to change your way of life? No, I don't think so, in a way. Uh, oh, I think you carry it with you is, is the secret. We wish you Godspeed. Thank you. All good luck. Well, what was the inspiration for Humphrey? I don't know. I think uh, camels are kind of weird. I agree with you. I never spent a great deal of time with camels, but this, uh, for the benefit of those of you who haven't heard it, is the brand new release, the sequel to the Tennessee Birdwalk, called Humphrey the Camel.